to my YouTube channel. If you are new, welcome to the family. We hope you're not just stopping by, but you actually hit that subscribe button because there's absolutely nothing we would love more than for you to join in on the family. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back once again. I absolutely appreciate it. I thank you for the likes, the comments, the shares, the everything that you guys do to make sure that the channel keeps growing. We have finally gathered the courage to wear a blonde wig. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel some type of way, but anyway, I think it's not bad at all. It's really not bad at all. Today we are doing something that's also not bad at all. As promised, I said I will be doing a part two winter jacket haul for you guys. And I have gathered all the winter jackets that I am going to definitely need because Gauteng is cold for days. Even as I record this, guys, I'm even lazy to go outside. Without any further ado, let's get right into it. Number one, and definitely my favorite, is this tan um, knee length coat. I absolutely am obsessed with it. And the nice thing about this coat is that um, everyone likes it. Whenever I put it on, everyone just wants to ask me, where did you get it? Unfortunately, I don't know where I got it because it does not belong to me. It is my husband's coat. And therefore, because of association, it belongs to me. This was 1,100 Rand. She bought it from another lady from our church. Mm, unfortunately, I can't give you guys a lot of information, but I have seen coats that are almost similar to this Cosmo Street. Ne? The quality is not quite the same, but nonetheless, they are beautiful coats. I've seen them go bafana bafana. I've seen them at all those many, many shops, Cosmo Street. I have seen something that looks almost similar to this. So let me show you guys how I would wear it. Alrighty, this is my leopard print dress that I got from Shein. I'm still going to do that Shein haul. I haven't forgotten. Um, it's just very difficult to sheet it on my own because, um, yeah, it's, it's too much admin. But anyway, this is how I rock this coat. I normally put it over my shoulder. Let me show you guys. This is how I normally wear it. Um, yeah, let's just fix this there and fix the hair. This is how I normally rock it. It's giving church, it's giving rich aunt, it's giving all the fabulosity, darling. I love, love, love this coat. I normally wear this outfit with black heels. And if you know me, you know that I absolutely hate black heels. But for some reason, with this outfit, they make absolute sense. You can definitely rock this any other way you want. It will still make sense. I love it this way. So let me show you guys my next fit. Number two of my absolute faves this winter is this beautiful bomber jacket. I got this for 300 Rand last year. Now, here's the thing with this particular bomber jacket. It is still there at Small Street, but the quality is no longer as amazing as this one. This was, I think, the first batch. Here's my thing about um, here's my thing about Diaparotoko Small Street. I feel like the first badge or the first stock is normally stronger, and then the more the demand, the the, the lower the quality. So you will definitely still find this, um, but it is definitely not the same quality. This is Mahona Chotle. I call it Mahona Chotle because I literally put it over any outfit, and the cold just disappears. I don't feel any kind of cold. This is a absolute need in your wardrobe. You need at least one bomba jacket, Nyana, because coats are stylish, but let's be honest, they are not as warm. Let's be 100% honest. If we're giving it 20 and 80, they are not that um, warm. So with this particular jacket, I love the fur here. Um, as you can, as you guys can see, there's a little bit of brown here because of my foundation. Um, I was wearing it today. So yeah, guys, it is for me the fur and also it's, it's so strong guys. It is really, really, really strong. I would definitely recommend that you guys look for something like this. It is very affordable. It is also um, very necessary and necessity in your wardrobe. Let me show you guys how I would pair it. 
guys, I'm just going to put it over this dress. I don't think we need to complicate the outfit. Absolutely love it. Love, love the fur, guys. If there's anything that I hate about this um, bomba jacket, it would definitely have to be this belt. I really don't see the point. I don't understand why they have it on here. And I don't know how to remove it, which frustrates me because I'm like, black in your kind. It's in your aesthetic, yeah, this thing you know but nonetheless i'm absolutely in love with it and once i find a way to get rid of this black black belt believe you me it's the first thing out of my house you know what i mean but yeah guys here it is 300 rand at that time i think this year it's probably like 350 or maybe 380 it shouldn't be that much the prices in small street don't don't change a lot, you know, if, if ELO deem it's like 350, 380 or something like that, you should be able to find it for less than 400 Rand. I love how warm it is. I love how convenient it is. It's also knee length, which means that, you know, it meets your boots at your knees. So there's no cold that will enter. That's why I absolutely love it. So yeah, guys, 300 Rand gets you this beautiful fur bomber jacket number three jacket coat rather is this beautiful coat i absolutely love it i got this at coat corner not at small street um and like i told you guys in the previous video the thing about coat corner coats is that you will find one nice coat and not find it the next day unfortunately so i don't think i don't promise that you guys will get exactly something like this but i do know that you'll probably get a pattern that looks almost like this absolutely love this jacket um I did mention to you guys that Coat Corner sells um, imported um, coats. So either they've been worn once or twice or they haven't been worn. They just put them in like a stash and they bring them to South Africa. So that's that. Um, I love this coat, like I said, but this is the part that I hate. I don't know why it's like that. I don't know whose idea it was to have this here. Um, I just think it's very unnecessary um, but luckily for me I can actually fold it and nobody needs to actually see this part of the collar really really hate that but in general I think it is a really stylish coat I don't think it's something that you want to buy if you want the warmth right if you do buy it I think you should then be ready to layer up especially on a really cold day I think you should be really ready to layer up because this is definitely not so warm but i mean i don't mind sometimes that's when we do drip is forever there's no need for you to to to, to wear the boom bali the what what sometimes you just want to look stylish you just want to pair it with something really cute and just you know rock so yeah guys let me show you guys how i would rock it so with this one i would definitely okay i love this thing going on at the back I don't know if you guys can see it i really love it i would still wear it with a simple turtleneck nothing complicated with these beige pants they are formal pants um yeah and then maybe once in a while just put over like a belt or or something just so that it's not super plain but really it's also another coat that does not need complication guys i'm so sorry that my hair is cut off this is the furthest i can go with these coats so I just want you guys to, to fully see how they look on me um, so that's why it will cut my head oftentimes so yeah guys this is this coat I love it love 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 it actually it's a bit warmer when you have like something inside but on its own not so warm the fourth coat is this coat this is how it looks guys I'm actually showing you guys these coats like this because I am shooting this on my own, so it's a bit of a struggle to have like a full length um, video that doesn't affect lighting. The further away I am from the camera, the lighting just becomes really terrible. But this is the fourth coat. Really, really, really love it. It's probably one of my stylish coats in my wardrobe. Um, if you are searching for warmth, my love, this is not it. This is not the coat you want to buy if you are looking for warmth. I, it's not gonna work. There is no, there's not even a layer of warmth in this. It's just for aesthetics. It's just to look cute. It's just 
to 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 drip and be nice and that's that you know um it's very very beautiful i love it and i think in ali will reach and you know i got this for like 180 if i'm not mistaken i think unfortunately with this one i don't exactly remember where i got it so i can't really really help with that um i don't think it's a complicated coat um you can wear it with really whatever um i definitely wouldn't wear it with this dress absolutely not i wouldn't wear it with this dress but um a nice turtleneck nice vest if lord it's not that cold i normally pair it with my long black knee length boots or my other beige knee length boots that's how i normally wear it um love 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 it i definitely would have loved it if loved it even more if these if they were tighter if these buttons were like tight on here so i might need to go to the tailor and actually get them to be a bit more tighter but n other than that guys nonetheless i'm really really impressed with this jacket i really really love it and i think you guys should at least have one of these in your wardrobe because well sometimes i don't know too but sometimes i don't know understand that you have to just silence the enemy guys this is how i normally wear this particular coat and simply because i don't think it needs to be complicated at all i generally also don't like layering up so um i am not a big fan of you know putting jerseys and things and things but also guys it's giving me tyler perry vibes tyler perry movie vibes you know you know those those coats that you wear and there's nothing underneath sorry i'm speaking to the married people right now and there's nothing underneath it's it's giving me that you know it's giving me that i i really love it i really love it i think it's very stylish last and definitely least is this beautiful it's beautiful i like the pattern um i think i got this for 100 rand guys um yeah it was definitely 100 rand i don't remember the shop properly but it was definitely 100 rand cosmos 3d it's not really my favorite because ugh, man the first few weeks after i bought it the buttons were already falling off so i wasn't like very impressed with that um yeah i don't know i was just like oh okay you're nice stylish man i normally put um a black big belt over and then i love it in all i love wearing it got all black right i definitely wouldn't wear it with this dress please i'm very stylish i'm a very stylish girl um yeah but otherwise man it, it, it's sharp it's not it's not terrible it's not amazing either it's just it's just okay it's just it's just fine would i urge you to buy it yeah i mean <laughs> you know if it makes you happy but you know, I hundred rand, so I didn't feel like I I lost a lot. But you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. So with this black coat, I definitely normally pair it with like a turtleneck, something that's just going to because it's short sleeved, which I don't understand. I really don't get it. I'm always like, but why are you? making a coat in a short sleeve why don't it for the cold why is it short sleeve but anyway that's besides the point this is how i rock it normally um i put like a big black belt over it and yeah guys it's not bad at all actually it's really not a terrible coat it's just not my favorite in my wardrobe all right guys we have come to the end of this video i hope you guys had so much fun as much as i did please do let me know if you guys want me to do more hauls otherwise please do not forget to like comment share subscribe and binge watch the content i will see you guys next time i love you guys so much from the bottom of my heart Mwah.